Jared, you, uh, you you come here to camp, kind of you know recap the performance. How do you feel like you did? Uh, I feel like I did, like mechanically, I did. I think I did all right and pretty pretty precise on the mechanics. And but like touch me on the ball, coach coach uh, Hazel gave me a few pointers that were very helpful uh, on the deep ball. But other than that, I think I did all right. Yes, sir. You pick up an offer after camp. Coach Hype gives you the news. Kind of take me through. I know it's not your first rodeo, offer number 23, but, uh, you know, in-state school picks up the offer. So kind of take me through uh, getting that offer for Coach Hype. It was, it was really exciting because they have came to school a couple times. I have not I have not thrown for them. And coming up here, the facilities were really nice. All around was really nice. And then uh, finally get to throw and have the chance to for them to see was uh, really exciting. When you're getting coached by Coach Halsley and Coach Heupel and they're kind of giving you a critique on your mechanics and stuff, what are they saying you do well? What are they saying you got to tighten up? Uh, just on a deep ball, like I w- sometimes I would have my shoulder too far to the uh, receiver, but I need to have it in if it's like a, a straight go ball. you got so many offers. You're just going into your sophomore year. Kind of take me through the process for you. Like what, what's this been like and, you know, how do you kind of stay grounded through it all? Uh, it's been real. It's been real fast. So, the first one came in eighth grade, and then after that, after Vanderbilt hit, it was kind of like it was like kind of like a roll, and I think it was like ten or eleven, and just span of a couple weeks. So it was real, it was amazing. For you, like you know, way ahead of the process than, than most kids, especially with the offers. How, how do you? kind of approach things are you trying to just kind of take it day by day or are you trying to say okay let's let's use this you know added time and kind of you know get some work done as far as the recruiting process by learning about schools and, and figuring out what they're all about I try to take it t- day by day and connect with coaches and like just hope to get down there one of the days if they can have me I'd love to go to any school that's interested in me and uh, just day by day what's it mean to pick up the Tennessee offer it, it's great in state power five along with Vanderbilt I love it. What What do you like about Coach Heupel? Uh He's real. He's a real laid back guy. He's he coaches you, and he also knows times for jokes. And he's a real, real giving person. When When you look at the fact that he played the position, Joey played the position. What kind of advantage is that to have guys, especially with Coach Heupel, who's you know in New York, at, you know, as a Heisman finalist? Uh, you know that they know what they're talking about. Like you're not coming out here and getting coached by people that haven't been in your position. But if you come out here and Tennessee, they have the people, they can coach you up right, and uh, everything they're teaching you, you know, it's, you know, it's on point. And you go into your high school season this year. What, what are the goals that you're trying to get done this year at uh, National Christian? State championship. Didn't, make, get, didn't get it last year. Come back this year, though. What will it take to make that happen? Um, hard work and um, dedication.